Gary from iPhoneInCanada.ca Yeah, it's gonna install an invisible shield onto my MacBook Pro. This is a, uh, a skin of 3M plastic material? Something like that. Yeah, but, uh, it's and tough. it skins the entire MacBook and protects it from scratches and stuff and dings and supposedly after everything's been installed, we can drop rocks and Scratch with keys, coins, you name it. Yeah, and it's supposed to be totally protected. That's right. Lifetime uh, warranty, John. Lifetime uh, warranty. Yeah. So if it scratches, we can uh, send an email. We'll get another one. And I'm kind of skeptical about it, so <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping to abuse it after it's all done. He only has one set, so this is only one time. You got to do this right the first time, or else you're going to get another one. Uh, yeah, that's right. I'm going to get another one. Yeah. But I'm sure it's going to be fine. Big video. Okay, step one is to basically wipe down a laptop with this supply cleaning product. I guess it's mostly well, this, alcohol based, right? It's it's actually a mild soap and water solution. Okay. Um, we're going to spray this on the laptop, but before we do that, we should get some sort of cloth to clean up your dirty laptop here. Oh, I guess see like food stains or something, John. Okay, I'll go get a cloth. Before we start. All right, now we're just giving the uh, MacBook a Thorough cleaning before we apply the uh, invisible shield That's skin. That's right, from our friends at zag.com. <laughs> uh, how do you spell that? Uh, InvisibleShield.com. Oh. InvisibleShield.com. We just want to get rid of any fingerprints, make sure you know the install is going to go well. Nice laptop, John. Okay, now that the laptop is all relatively clean, uh, the next tip is to figure out where all the pieces go. I, I assume like, this piece goes right there. And is it hard to take apart? Uh, it's fairly simple. Uh, they, uh, they give some pretty simple instructions. What you should do, many people don't do this, is... Uh, it's a one-page instruction sheet. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, it's pretty straightforward for all the invisible shields. You just peel off the plastic, you spray on the solution, and you put it on. All right, we'll be doing that next. Yeah. Okay, folks. First things first, uh, I'm just going to spray my, my fingers down a little bit with this mild solution here. Okay. Next up, I'm gonna spray the, the MacBook Pro. Okay, let's move my iPhone. Now, don't be afraid to spray lots of the solution, okay? Because it will we can squeegee out any uh, bubbles. We just wanna make sure we got enough on there. That looks like enough to me. Now, let's peel the skin. The skin. Remember, we only have one shot of this. <laughs> I'm getting nervous, John. Okay, here we go. Big piece of plastic. Yeah, it's a big piece of plastic. Big piece of plastic, okay. It's going on. Okay, I'm waiting. Oh. oh. Off, but we can move it. Okay, let's spray my so uh, I'm just gonna use this. This is the included squeegee, right? Yeah, free squeegee. Yeah, squeegee yes. out some of the water the bubbles. And, uh, make sure we have a uh, paper towel close by. You can soak up any of the excess water. Just gotta go lightly here. Any air bubbles go out. Now, this product is not only available for. Apple, can, is it available for other um, computers as Yeah, well? you can get it for PCs, um, you can get it for uh, iPhone, I have one on my iPhone, um, Blackberries. Yeah, this on the iPhone, the Invisible Shield. You can't even see it because it's, well... It's invisible. It's invisible. <laughs> and it, I can feel it, just can't see it. <laughs> no. and there you go. The lid is done. Looks great. And it's shinier than normal too because it has a shiny plastic film on it. 